Hey friends, welcome to Dada's Kitchen. I hope you guys are doing well. Today I am back with one more recipe called Prawns Masala or Shrimp Masala. This is a recipe which is a simple yet yummy recipe which can be cooked less than 30 minutes. So let's get started. So friends, time to look at the ingredients required for this recipe. We will need some finely chopped onions, some red and green chilies, some curry leaves, some lime, tomatoes finely chopped, coriander leaves. We'll need some ginger garlic paste. We'll also need some uh, prawns which I have marinated with salt and turmeric and kept it for some time, some shredded coconut and some Indian spices like red chili powder, some turmeric powder, salt and garam masala for this recipe. Time to heat up the pan and add some finely chopped onions and saute for 5 minutes. So friends, if you are new to our channel and have not seen our previous videos, please subscribe, comment and like our videos and enjoy. So friends, once you see the onions turning pink, you need to now add some red chilies and green chilies, some curry leaves and saute it for 2-3 to three minutes. ginger garlic paste you need to saute the ginger garlic paste for two to three minutes and this is to ensure that the smell of the ginger garlic paste goes out once that happens then you need to add some tomatoes and cook it again Friends, once you see the tomatoes have become a little soft, time to add the shredded coconut and cook it for 2-3 to three minutes more. So friends, time to add some Indian spices, I'm adding some salt, some red chili powder, some turmeric powder, some garam masala and optional Kashmiri red chilli to give the colour and flavour to this particular recipe. So friends, let's cook the Indian spices along with this masala for the next 5 minutes till we find that oil has been released from this masala. Once that happens, then we will add the marinated prawns in this and cook it for 10 minutes. However, do note that when prawns are cooked, they do release water. So if you're looking for a thick gravy, then you don't need to add water. But since I like a little bit of wet gravy, so I'm adding water over here, which is completely optional. So friends, to give an authentic Indian style prawns masala taste, I'm adding some lime and then I'm cooking it for another 10 minutes in a low flame. So friends, today's recipe is an authentic Indian style prawns masala. In India, people make different types of prawns masala, which is some people say it as malwani, some say it as kuan curry and all that. 
Uh, today's recipe is a little different with a twist and I hope you liked our recipe today. If you are new to our channel and have not seen our previous videos, do go and check out our recipes. They are awesome and please help us to support, like, subscribe to our channel because this will keep us motivating and working harder. Thank you very much. Have a good day. Bye.